what it hit for now. What it hit for now. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel, it's your girl Kyra Sean. So for today's video, I'm giving you guys a first impression on a unit that was sent to me by Ebony Line. But before we get into all the specs of this unit and what I think about it straight out the pack, make sure if you're new to the channel, you go ahead and subscribe and smash the notification bell so you don't miss anything else coming up. Also give this video a thumbs up if you wanna see more videos like this in the future. Let's go. Okay, so before you ask, let's go ahead and talk about the elephant in the room, okay? Yes, I changed my setup yet again. You guys know my setup was over there in that corner somewhere. Where I can't even turn, there we go, there we go. It was back there, I changed my mind again so there we go. Okay, so the unit we're talking about is from the Sensational Cloud 9 Swiss Lace What Lace Wig Line. She is Miss Camille. This is what her car looks like. I got her in the color 1B and she does retail for $46.95, I think. Let me check really quick. Oh, my phone is locked. God dang it. Yes, $46.95, okay? So definitely in that medium price point for synthetic wigs. Now, even though the What Lace Wig Line has been out for exactly a year now, if you're new and you don't know what I'm talking about, all the units in this collection do come with a 13 by six lace parting area. So it's 13 inches from ear to ear, as well as six inches deep of parting space in the middle. It also has two combs on the side, one comb in the back, and the adjustable straps. I would say for my 23 inch head, this unit is fitting down pretty good on my head. So I would definitely say it is big head friendly. However, I do have my hair cornrowed under this unit, and I also have on my wig grip. So my big hair girls, Gina Gina action, you're good to go. If you're bigger than that, then leave your sides down, okay? This unit is a premium fiber unit, so she is heat safe up to about 400 degrees. However, it already comes curled like this. They come in like a, just like that other one just like Darlene you know that crimping curl that's what this is okay because it's like a wine curl mixed with like a crimp so that's what we got going on here. And I will tell you guys, I was swayed initially from trying this unit at all. I was not going to try it. It was not my cup of tea, okay? And I was going to go ahead and sip something else. But I was like, you know what? Let me go ahead and try it for myself and see what it's hitting for, what it hit for now, what it hit for now. So here we are. Based on the reviews that I saw, good and bad, and based on my experience with Darlene, I knew not to finger comb nor brush this unit. Don't do it, Pam, okay? Because it just can't handle it. Gently take a rat tail comb like I did slip and slide and move that joint over because if you try to do anything other than that you're gonna run into some problems and situations okay even with me just parting the hair and moving them over the flyaways and the tangles started happening okay I had some tangles down in this area um shedding wise I got like one or two oh I lied see is, there I go I'm about to tell y'all one or two and I just pulled out like a whole little clump right there so <laughs> so shedding yes now we'll say if you do decide to brush your unit you more than likely would have to go in with some products, your mousses, your holding spray frizzies, some type of serum, things like that, to smooth out that hair again, and then brush it through, smooth it down, brush it through, smooth it down, to get the curls back to this. Because the way the curls are, they will get bigger and bigger. Once you start tangling though, do some, do some other things, maybe trim, stuff like that. So you can preserve these units if you choose to. If this unit was in a better texture, this unit would be bomb. I said it with Darlene, I'll say it again with Camille. Let's try that human hair blend out, okay? let's. let's Let's, let's try that out, Sensational. For it to be a short unit, I don't feel like there should be tangles. She can give you the look now, okay? She may even be able to give you a couple wears, but if you start doing too much with this unit, mm -mm, she not gonna last. With the lace, we already know about the lace. If you don't know about the lace, it's ashy. So you gotta do what you gotta do to you know blend her in for your skin tone. I did take a tip from Natural Joy um, to look up in my mirror, like this, up and up, and then blend my foundation that way so that I could see the line of demarcation and disappearing. Now I know y'all can see this right here because I can see it but it may not look as noticeable when I look head on 
See what I'm saying? I think if I would've used more product than I had on my sponge, I would've been, you know, a little bit more successful in blending this down, but I just used my excess that was on the sponge that I already had from putting my face makeup on and left it at that. Um, my girl Aya All Day did put her wig on before she did her makeup, which I have done before, and she did blend a lot better. I did go in with some powder in my parting space to, you know, blend that into me a little bit. That's pretty much it on the hairline, okay? I did not glue this unit down. There she go, see? Up, down, up, down. I did use a teensy little bit of my um, edge booster, which is this little joint right here. Just a, like around the hairline, just to kind of, you know, lay the flyaways down. Look, look at Cindy Lou, look. She about, to, she about to attack my eyelash. Look, look, look. Get out of here. And that is all. So let me show you guys what she looks like from the side, okay? This is how she looks from the side. So she has like a little angled cut going on. And then to the back. Here we go. And then to this side. Oh, I went around. I went all the way around. Look at that, look at that. All in all, I think this is an okay unit. I do like her better than Darlene because she is a lot less hair to manage. There's not a lot of hair around my neck. So I would definitely tell you to buy at your own risk. If you wanna get some looks out of this unit, you definitely can. Do not come back to me and be like, oh, I bought that unit based on your thumbnail and now I'm mad because it's tangles. Girls and Gary, I hope you watched the whole review so you know my thoughts on this unit. Maybe even watch somebody else's. Get different opinions on the units before you buy so you know, okay? A thumbnail and a cute video not gonna make me buy a unit most of the time. But when it's units like this, when I'm spending some coin on, some I want to make sure I get, you know, all the facts in the tea before I buy. I think if you do buy the unit and you know what to expect from it, you will not be disappointed. Now, this unit also comes in some really cute colors, okay? It comes in that money piece selection, the burgundies, the greens, the mustard yellows, blah, blah, blah. But I feel safe and warm at night when I get a 1B because I know it's going to last a little bit longer, okay? That's just what it is. The specialty colors are specialty for a reason, okay? To get your money's worth, keep your hands out your hair. Go to Hands Anonymous, do what you got to do to practice what I'm preaching. Now I gave Darlene a seven. I would give this one, I think I would give this one like a seven and a half, maybe pushing eight. And eight how she is now. I'm not mad at it for how it looks right now. And this flyaway, this flyaway is getting on my nerves. I definitely could see myself rocking her out for a quick little date night. She do give me a look, don't she? Look, look. She may not be moving right now as much because I sprayed her down, but she bouncy, okay? She is bouncy. Let me not bounce too much because she gonna get unruly. Back start poofing up like a poodle skirt. Good grief. But that's all I got for you guys today. Shout out to Ebony Lime for sending me this unit. I really appreciate it. I will put all the specs for my particular unit down below. So if you guys want to check it out, you can. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Don't forget to smash the notification bell down below so you don't miss any videos coming up in the future. I love you guys so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.